These are rebels in a society that expects women to be passive. And sometimes they don't know their own strength. Sorry. The gentility may be endearing, but their coach would like to instill a little more aggression before their first international contest against women from North Africa. Is it hurting? A little bit. But I think it's interesting to have this brain. All across the Middle East, women are treated like second-class citizens and are regarded very much as the weaker sex. But these boxes are striking a blow for women across the region. Although at the moment, they're not hitting as hard as the men. The women's boxing team was set up by Jordan's Prince Rashid. While they may have the blessing of the country's royal family, they face bitter disapproval from traditionalists. They don't think you're a good girl if you do this. You know, I'm just playing because I like the game. I don't want anybody to say that I'm not a good girl. I play boxing because I like it. I'm a sporty girl. I was born like that. And I don't really care what men think. Um, it's just what I think of it. Um, I do whatever I believe in. I want to be strong and I want to challenge guys. <laughs> That's all. The boxing ring is just one area where Jordan is trying to promote greater sexual equality. And even if the men don't approve, they're on message. No, for Riyadh, I want to be universal, a sports universal. Riyadh is open to any game. The Saudi will do it and the Kuwait will do it and the Urdun will do it. Of course, all the fights have a night and a night. ولازم تكون الملاكمة يعني مش بس يعني منظر أو بالهيكل. The girls can count on family support, not least because most are from mixed marriages with Jordanian fathers and European mothers who want their daughters to continue breaking down the barriers of sexual prejudice. آه أكيد يعني خوردانيا يعني it's good for Jordan to have the freedom for women to do whatever they like and to have the equality between men and women and I hope it will happen to other Arab countries. Well, I hope this is a new beginning. We don't want discrimination between men and women in our society. It's difficult to imagine conservative Arab nations ever allowing female boxing, but revolutions have to start somewhere, and who knows, perhaps this will be the catalyst. Malcolm Brabant, BBC News, Amman.